All right, but guys. Do either of you have epilepsy or had seizures or any other unusual unusual reactions? Are you having an epileptic seizure <laughs> right now? <laughs> uh, I've never had any of this to date, but okay. uh, hey, I'm willing to play until the date where I do have it. So this is a... What are you talking about, Adam? <laughs> well, I'm just saying if I were to play a game and on a certain date, I would end up having it. Please, please hit A as well. We can't have this be the okay. screen for so- <laughs> <laughs> Well, I, as uh, uh, me being Ben Vanell, was excited just to look at that screen. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I've never been more bored in my life than having to read the, the we used to do it all. This is cool. Yeah, what are we yeah. looking really at cool. here? My name's Adam Knox. My name's Tommy Daslow. This is my play date that came in the mail uh, two days ago. We're having a little fuck around with it mm. for a video here. And uh, boy, i got to tell you, getting it out of the box, firing it up, the excitement of months and months of waiting for it in the mail and then being immediately greeted with a harsh warning sign. <laughs> Really makes you feel that thrill of a new piece of hardware. I came in the mail two days ago as well, um, but it was like <laughs> it, it did feel very Nintendo-y and that in in the way mm. that this is just designed as like a goofy weird bit of hardware that's all supposed to make you have fun. Yeah, yeah. this feels very Nintendo-y to me. Nicely in a curated way. introduction as well. Look at this, yeah. Ooh. Teaching you the controls in a fun little way. So you're moving that around, Tommy, with yep. the arrows. Yeah. So we've got this like plugged in with. That's a nice sound. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I'll stop doing that. <laughs> <laughs> USB uh, into the computer, and it's got like a little mirroring app, yeah. so you can look at this thing. But the actual machine itself, if you've <laughs> never seen one before, <laughs> I feel like I was a cunt talking at like a band show. <laughs> yelling it's just like, the openers, it's fine. Yeah. <laughs> and now it's asking me to use the crank. Now this the- is the big oh. thing. Yeah. You've got this nice little piece of hardware that's made by Teenage Engineering mm. uh, alongside Panic, who's the Playdate company. Yes. They make, like, the OP1 and a bunch of synthesizers that are very expensive but very well made. Yeah, you'll see them on, like, a million design blogs. They're beautifully uh, beautifully constructed. Now, this yeah. isn't malfunctioning. I'm doing this deliberately. Hell yeah. But look, guys, Wiggler's turned up. <laughs> There's Wiggler. Oh. He's got a new hat. Oh, he's about to get crushed. Fun. And this, I mean, you're probably not getting the full effect of it on this video, but it looks incredible. On the little, like, LCD screen on the thing, it Mm. looks amazing. It's got a cool little glossy kind of finish to it. (laughs) (laughs) Settings! Now, it doesn't always do that. Um, (laughs) No, that is where we left it, isn't it? I I love a bit of, um, yeah, a bit of a video intro on a console where you first fire it up and Mm. you've got, like, that cool little effect. It's neat that it lets you replay it uh, whenever you want. That is cool. And then, uh, yeah, what you would typically start on would be... Uh, this so season one of the games that are going to come with the play date. You get two new ones every week, and it has this cool little effect where they're when you first turn it on, they're they're wrapped in a little you know package. Oh, hit A, and a little hand comes and hit pulls a off Kojima. the ribbon. Yeah, what <laughs> you said, hit A. <laughs> Did he? <laughs> yeah. yeah. You Rewind a. the tape. Use that crank. Go back <laughs> on the table. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. You hit A. Hideo Kojima. Uh, <laughs> oh, yeah, okay. Now uh, I get it. Now I'm fired up. Uh, that's all of the other guys laughing. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, this is um this is season one so far. So that's what? One, two, three, four games? Yeah, so I got this Monday morning and I thought the games refreshed a week after you turning it on for the first time. Mm-hmm. But it's actually at the same time of the week kind of for everyone. So right. it's like Monday afternoon Melbourne time. So okay. I opened it, got the games that came with it, and then a few hours later it refreshed. Right. The day when the your play date goes off at the same time as your be real <laughs> yes. is going to be such an exciting moment for you. So you get... Yeah. What, is you, it well, like, you'll see all the other people with play dates on be real <laughs> posting about it. It's, well, in, in 19 months when they've shipped them all out. So, yeah. yeah, I've got mine in the mail at some point too. They're, they've taken a while as, you know, international production stuff is difficult at the moment, but... I had mine in the mail on the weekend. Uh, what? <laughs> Hideo. <laughs> and so they. I'm they, the only one left that hasn't done one. They give Someone you a, say mail at some point, please. Okay, they give right. you a total of like 20 something games in this first season. Is that right? Two a week for 12 weeks. So yeah, there'll be right. 24 total uh, over the course well, how'd of How'd you do that math so fast? Um, I opened the calculator on your computer uh, while so you were looking. Yes. Have a look around at these ones. Yeah, yeah, well, let's start with this. This is kind of. This is sort of the first one that's on the screen when you first get it. This is probably the most sort of. I guess, uh, like tech demo-y kind of mm-hmm. of all of them. This only uses the crank. This is... I'm going to turn this down yeah, for the yeah, love go for of it. God. How is the speaker? Because we've got this plugged into the computer speakers. How is the speaker on the thing itself? When it's great. Yeah, nice. it's really clear. Sounds awesome. So this is like you're just using the crank 
and it's uh it's very hard to get used to, but you're you're surfing. You're doing a little California games. Wow, Tommy. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't so think the rude. video was that boring, but anyway. <laughs> that crank that you've got, I imagined it when this thing was sort of announced as being having little little clicks in it. You know, when you turn mm. a crank and it's got little sort of feedback clicks as you move it. It looks as though it's just a smooth sailing. It is, yeah. It's really completely smooth. Mm. Right. Yep. Um, so this is, yeah, There's this is pretty simplistic game. Uh, there's like an online leaderboard where you can, you know, see all the high scores. But, uh, yeah, you basically... It takes a little while to get used to, but you're kind of trying to control yourself here and then do a bit of this fucking action. Yes! Nice. Yeah. Wow, Tony Hawk, the surfer. <laughs> <laughs> Kelly Slater? Kelly oh. Slater, you got it, Christian's brother. Yep. Oh. Kelly Slater. Kelly Slater. Uh, wow, that's a great oh, combo. Dude, be- be- honestly, be better. <laughs> Pretty simple, but yep. a bit of fun looking. And I love the visuals of this. Mm, the yeah. sort of um, old-fashioned, I-, I forget what that stuff's called, but there's a term for it with those kind of cross-hatching effects on the black yes. Oh, yes. yes. Oh, wait, that's not going to work because I'm not on Ben's internet. But, um, yeah, so that's, that's Whitewater Wipeout. Uh, hey, you're number one in the world. Look at that. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Go back to... I want to see the global rankings. Oh, I can't, I've got to get on your internet. Oh, sure, sure, it. sure. Um, I've got parental controls in, in, <laughs> in action, so obviously... <laughs> Have a know, look at... Uh, I want to see a bird catch or whatever that was. Casual, Casual birder. birder. Casual birder. All right. This is... Uh, I think... Okay. So this is... um, This is a pretty... Uh, Robust game. You're. It's mm. like a little RPG. You're a little guy in this bird town. Uh, you're a bird watcher. You've got this little um, this gang of no good nicks of uh, in the town. There's like a bird watching competition, and basically the game is you're using the crank to kind of scroll through your items. Oh yes. up the top there, and then you got your little camera phone that you're you can move around <laughs> oh. here, and you're like spotting birds, and then you're using the crank to get more into focus. Wow. On them there, and then you take a little photo. Oh. And you got your little, got a new bird. I love that it's based, the camera phone is like a representation of what you're holding as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah. really cool. So you're basically, you're going around this town and you're, um, you're doing little quests for people and you're, you're picking up items and doing a little, little bit of like old school uh, Zelda, you know, trade mm-hmm. off, give this item to this person kind of stuff. Uh, and you're trying to. You're trying to get photos of every bird in the town. Yeah, it's a little bit like Pokemon Snap if it was like the old school version of Pokemon. Yeah. Right? Getting, get it, Walking around, uh, getting photos of birds. Oh, a bit like Adam's be. blog that he has. Yeah, yeah. Well. <laughs> Except yeah. Your, your, cam- your, your camera's on your shoe, not the... Yeah, mine often aren't in focus because I don't have enough time. <laughs> yeah. But I yeah. didn't even Swallows, notice Swallows, right? That, Swallows dot blogspot. Some of them your... do. But the... the, the Little bird there, I didn't even know. And so, this is a very cool looking little thing. Yeah. yeah. The fact that this is. Oh, how okay, how long focus, do you reckon yeah. this is? Because I saw you had a save there that was like you were five levels in or something like that. Oh, yeah. I've. I've or I've, five birds, maybe. Yeah, I've been. Uh, I've just kind of been dicking around with this in. I've kind of been playing a little bit of everything. Right. Um, but, uh, yeah, I don't know. I think this is. I think I read somewhere this is like three hours or something like that. All right. Why won't it let me go back? Oh, I've got a, I've got too many photos. Okay. Oh, oh yeah. There we go. <laughs> He's an no, eleven out of ten, but he could get <laughs> photos of birds in bird town. It's his job. Uh, this looks cool. Mm. I like when this was announced. Again, the the sort of gimmicky nature of having this little handheld that looks a bit like back when they used to make those cheap kind of LCD screen knockoffs of Game Boys. It'd be like oh yeah, one hundred and twenty seven games in one, yep. and sixty five of them are variants of Tetris and whatever. Mm-hmm. This reminds me of that in appearance, but then the games are a lot more in depth. And also, there's a pretty robust, to my understanding, um, game development program that you can get for free to make your own playdate games. Right. Like yeah. that's that appears to be the difference between something like you know the, those throwback ones, Nox, where all of these games are made by you know passionate indie game developers. So they all have personality. Like this, you know, the art style, the character design is is you know it's not it's distinct. Yeah. It, it well, has yeah. So Panic, the company that made it, yeah. This first season of stuff are all um, yeah. They've gone and commissioned like mm. indie developers that they like. Um, yeah. This is a this is a so this is the other one that you get. Straight out of the box with right. Whitewater Wipeout. So you get a cool little sort of like 
almost tech dem- demo-y thing that just uses the crank. And then you get this, yeah, neat little couple of hour RPG where, yeah, you're just going around trying to get photos of all the birds that, mm. are, that are in the town. And Great. you have various little things that you have to do to coax them out or... Right. Yeah. Um, so this is, yeah, I've been enjoying this. Mm. Um, so uh, I'll show you the... Well, yeah. So you guys were talking about the um, the the uh, what would you call it the the other the people that have games that people have made using the like dev kits that oh, are yeah, really yeah, easy yeah, to get yeah. online. So this is all them. They're really easy to load onto the console. Uh, there's, there's heaps a, already as there's, well. There's, right? there's yeah. heaps. Yeah. There's the, and Panic have been really good about putting out lists of like the ones that they're sort of like giving a bit of a boost up to. Mm. Um, this is one of the cooler ones. This so you're uh, shredding documents uh, as many as you can without the lawyer spotting you. And right, so, super corporate tax evader. It looked like it mm, said. Yes. So to put the shredder away, you like dock. Like the the crank has like a little kind of dock that it sits in. Oh. So that also registers as well when that's folded in. Right. So that's like a second input kind of thing for it. Mm. So you're just doing this, and you're sort of paying attention to what's happening up the top in mm-hmm. the dialogue here, mm-hmm. and just kind of seeing how many you can get. I'm just waiting for right. him to... This reminds me of that, like, WarriorWare game where your mum comes into your yeah. room sometimes to check what you're doing in there. And it's kind of all... It's sort of all randomised. He's sort of waiting for little cues that he's going to come into the room. Let me get the diagrams. I'll check, check the, the vault. vault. Oh, oh, yeah. oh <laughs> fuck. That was fast. Yeah. Because it's... It's also the the crank's on a bit of a kind of clicker thing, so it's very hard to like get it in quickly. It's on a hinge, oh, brother. That, yeah, it, like magnetizes to the side. It looks right. like yeah. Thing. I'm cranking. <laughs> I'm shredding. I'm shredding, baby. Just put it away. L- show us what it looks like yeah. now. Play it safe. <laughs> nice. <laughs> hey, <laughs> nothing. Just sitting here in the document <clears throat> shredding room with yeah. my hands clasped. Yep. Making a little church, a yeah. steeple with I'm my hands. Crouching down next to a funny license plate <laughs> right here, getting a photo taken of me doing the prayer hands. <laughs> Let's see. Yeah, a warrior wear on this would be great. Oh, yeah. Well, that's kind of the idea of the whole it's thing sort of, in a way. Yeah. yeah. Well, down to the fact that the colour scheme of it when it's got the. Uh, the the ca- on. case yes. on is, uh, is very warrior. Oh, we should make like a filthy wear. <laughs> Oh yeah. Well, I would love to have a little look at the game development thing. Yeah. I've never, never developed a game. You might be surprised to hear. I'm no donkey, but I, uh, <laughs> I, I, I donkey my donuts into a little coffee every day rather than I, I've never done that in my life. Banana toffee pudding. Never had that either. All right. So that's uh, yeah. That's a that's an example of like a I don't nice. know what you call them. It, it's not an indie because they're kind of all indies on here. But um, hmm. yeah, just a. a Homebrew thing? What, sure. Yeah. Homebrew is probably the closest word. But then if they've got their own sort of, it sounds like they've got like a store or whatever. A, yeah. Not yeah. for money, but like a, a, a depository of these games somewhere. Yeah. Yeah. So these are all super easy to load onto it. Um, lots of cool little puzzle things here. This is like a, this has just come out. This is getting a lot of uh, uh, attention. People E-tat. are really, really into this. This E-tat guy E-tat wants to make backwards. Uh, I know. That's what I was thinking. What Legend the is fuck? Denegle backwards. <laughs> yeah, there's a point where in this they're talking about um, Etad, Y apostrophe lap, E lap. Right. And it's like, all right. Yeah. Maybe I get it. You should have just thought of your own nouns, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> um, but this is like a cool kind of, yeah. Dungeon, dungeon crawlery oh, thing. Oh, yeah. Yeah, like an uh, Ultima uh, Underworld. Fuck yeah, yeah, like Dagglefall. Daggle, daggle Dagglefall. You can see the daggle little fall. holes in the ground there where the spikes come yeah, out Yeah, stop of. walking into the spikes. Okay. That's what I would do personally. <laughs> All right. It's just I would not walk into the spikes in an underground dungeon maze. That Elap, he is crafty. <laughs> <laughs> he really knows how to trick you. Okay, so. Have a little oh. swipe with your sword. Oh, hell nice. yeah. Nice. Yeah. Fuck. Oh, that made me feel like I was clicking a mouse and then dragging the <laughs> mouse around to swing the sword. Fucking weird, outdated. And the person who made this, this, this is just like they're saying this is chapter one and their mm. their plan is to, yeah. There were some cranks remake. back there. Were there? Yeah. G- turn right. Oh, no, that was to open the gate. Can you crank oh, right. them, though, with the crank? Can you bring that door down on your head? Nah. I don't think you can. Oh, over there. Once it's open, it's... Hey, oh. yeah, all right. yeah, there we go. Hey. All right. I'm yeah, cranking. Nice. I know how to crank. I'm opening doors. That's cool. So yeah, the fact that you can make something like this on it, uh, you know, it's it's 
it's it looks the style of it when you boot it up and a lot of the stuff that's been made on it does look very like game and watchy and very sort of simplistic kind of graphics. Mm. Right. It's cool that you can make something that's this complex. Right, like a, a simulated 3D. Yeah, yeah, kind of 3D looking, but yeah, this is this has just come out and again Panic have done a lot of like boosting it up and mm. it's been really really well received. So yeah, hopefully the person makes the next two chapters that they wanted to make for it. Um, and a lot of these are, like, you you do pay money for them. They're, like, a couple of bucks, I think. Oh, really? Okay. A lot of them, yeah. So this, I haven't started this one yet, uh, but Bloom is, like, apparently a Stardew Valley Animal crossing oh. kind of thing that's really, really, like, long and got a lot in it. And this was, like, ten bucks. But, um, yeah, apparently that's another one people are loving, which is sort of, like, I think caught people by surprise with how um, how much there is to it. Mm. Um, okay, so I'll take you back into... So this is the second batch of games that right. downloaded onto it. Um, this guy was pretty heavily featured in, like, the reveal Yes, video. I remember him because you move him with the crank, right? Yeah, I'll take you back to just the... I'll go to the, the first level with it. Whoops. So this is purely crank-based. Yeah. <laughs> to be to be clear, Tommy is just moving the menu with the crank here. Yeah. Mm. So you're... You're running on a date and, yeah, you're controlling the speed of him. Okay. The speed of the crank. This one I love. The style of it. The The fluidity is really cool, yeah. Okay, so that was well just animated. walk over there. Oh, and so you need to be there at the time? But how are you going to do that? You're already late. No, don't stop to sniff the flowers. Bad advice. Late uh, again. Uh, on to the third date. I'm getting a lot of chances PM. here. Yeah. Bitch, run! <laughs> <laughs> well, the time moves relative to the speed that you're going at. But what does start to happen is shit like oh. this. Mm -hmm. More See that little exclamation? Whoop. Yep. Lovely town. Here oh, comes no, a little butterfly. Not a butterfly. Uh -oh. See, what happens if I'm standing up? Bonk. Oh, uh, I'd die too. Yeah. <laughs> and my date would be unimpressed that I got killed by a butterfly. That's... A butterfly landed on my head. Well, it ruined Mike Pence when a fly oh, landed true. on his head. <laughs> that was, yeah, so he was He died. Yeah, they're that. all like, let's go kill Mike Pence because of the fly <laughs> thing. Well, his wife left him at least. I know that for sure. So, yeah, what you're doing in this is yeah. you, you know, you have set little kind of things that happen in the animation cycle mm -hmm. and little obstacles are coming along and you're trying to time uh, what you're doing to avoid getting bonked by the butterfly and right. other things that come along. Still late, though. Took You're me half an hour so to avoid those butterflies. Yeah. later than ever. That's she my cutoff. She should set the date for later, though. To be fair, if she's mm. giving you more chances, be like, okay, we can meet at four. So I'll take you to the level that I'm up to. Okay. Because it does get really fucking hard. I think there's like 50 levels in this. Okay. Wow. So you start having sex on, like, the fourth date, <laughs> and from that point on, surely you're at, like, you know, watching reality TV together. <laughs> ah, fuck. Yeah, that little uh, That little poo-poo got, poo -poo got this you. This is like you've got a little animation cycle when you're swinging on the thing where your legs are up at some point. Oh, you gotta, shit. Ah, fuck. <laughs> it, it's, gotta get that shit! It's very precise. My advice would be to avoid Ooh. the shit. Yeah, there you go. Ooh. You took my advice. Thank you. <laughs> I reckon uh, avoid the show oh again. Oh, no, man. You should follow my do you wanna, advice. Do you want a little crack, Ben? <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'll hold the mic for you. Thank you. All right, Ben. Uh, if you can get this first Wait, go, you, uh, you're the sex god. So where are we? Oh, okay. So I've got to go. Oh, uh, shit. Okay, yeah. I've got a piece of advice <laughs> for you. <laughs> I've got a piece of advice for you. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> oh, well, I'll choose not to follow the advice of you guys so as, where? as you guys have been. <laughs> so he's like halfway through the... Halfway through the cycle, his legs are up in the air. So you and you can go back as well. So you're trying uh, to like, oh, fuck. It's uh, the crank is so fluid. It's very hard to yeah to be precise with it. I think that's part oh, of why there you I go. Kinda, oh fuck. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> why I thought it was gonna have the clicks because it does have like a clicking sound effect that it kind of does for some of them too. There you go. Oh, you're there. dodging that shit. Okay. That wily shit. And now get ready for a, oh, not a bird. Little gaps in your oh, in your little right, in there that right. the birds will fly through. Like okay. a like a backwards Rayman. His torso is all different bits. So this does feel like a very like modern take on a game and watch thing. Like a just very simplistic concept that gets that just starts throwing more and more shit at you mm. the further on you go. Oh come on, mate. <laughs> um, it's uh, it's fun. It's tough. It's 
It's cool to have a thing that is just a completely new, like, control scheme that you have to get used yeah, to. Yeah, yeah. Not just, like, button inputs or anything like that. It's, like, a whole new way of, yeah, of moving a character on screen. And so if you, when you when you hook it up to the computer with this mirror app, you can use a controller where it'll just take the, oh, uh, the right... Oh, another bird behind. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, that's, that's enough for me. Yeah, it'll that is you, quite difficult. It'll let you rotate the right stick on the controller in, in place of the crank. Is the idea somehow yeah. these cords all got super tied together in that one moment? So um, <laughs> that was the toughest game of all. I'm yeah, those there's cords. also there's this which is like a, a another homebrew kind of one that's I think has been done as a bit more of a simplistic uh, take on that last game mm-hmm. where oh, you're, right. just, you're riding a unicycle you're using the crank to control your balance. Um, it's got difficulty Ooh. modes in it, so you can have like more assist with the gravity. Um, but yeah, this is. This is Do you want cool. to pass this over to Nox? Yeah, I'll, I'll, give hold little, the... I'll give it a little go. There's no rooting in this one. There's only... Oh, well, then take this back. Because <laughs> this mustache man... Mustache man on a unicycle. That's my type. Okay, sorry. All right. Uh, try again. So I'm looking at the little screen here to do it. This guy... Oh, well... <laughs> go I mean, off screen! How far back <laughs> <laughs> um, do you want to go back and start from level one? God, how patronizing was that? <laughs> do you want some crayons? <laughs> <laughs> so how would you even mo- How do you I, get forward momentum? I've yeah. never ridden a unicycle in my life. Yeah, go maybe you, I think you maybe go Maybe start a little quicker. Go back a little <laughs> <laughs> Go back a little Oh, and back tip a little yourself so forward. tilting so yeah, then you yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, very here smart. Uh, 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 here we go. Here yeah, we go. Have that, like little bit of forward momentum. Oh. oh. Don't worry mate. I love the art style of this and yeah. Again, yeah. just a fully Whoa. Fuck yeah. This bitch be cycling. Oh, he be, he be uni uni uniing. I reckon I get. Oh, there you walk. go. Oh, I'm getting to the coffee. Of yeah. Course I am. This, it. I hate. This is what people think Melbourne is. A cunt riding a <laughs> unicycle to a flat white. It or, is though. Yeah. <laughs> or three cunts sitting around pretending to be a cunt riding yeah, a unicycle yeah. to a flat this white. This has to have been made by someone in Sydney. <laughs> oh. now, the microphone was drifting up in front of my eyes. That was part. Oh of yeah. I'm, <laughs> I'm not looking. I should just look at the screen. The Here we go. At. Here we go. Don't worry, everybody. Beans are coming. My name's Beans. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I want to hack yeah. this so instead of getting to the coffee beans, it's actual Mr. Bean standing there. <laughs> yeah, this sh- should have been called Mr. Beans. Yeah. To avoid copyright. All right. It's cool that it gives you the mm. little graph of your balance yeah. at the end there. I like that. I wanted to have a look as well. At oh, yeah, this, go for uh, it. little one at the top, right? So is this the home button? Here we go. There's a little uh, musical one. And uh, I'll just Why don't you sit down for this, Knox, in the in the big boy yeah, chair? Sure, we can, we can swap over. around. If yeah. it takes a second, we can... Like, I'll just keep talking the whole time. Well. And uh, hopefully, you know, this is still really interesting content. Um, All right, I've switched. <laughs> <laughs> just, yeah, slide that out a little bit. Here we go. We're in my tiny desk space. These pandas dancing to absolutely nothing to the sound of Ben (laughs) filling. (laughs) Dancing to riffing. Uh, All right. So we got a little piano roll here. This one was called Boogie Loops, was it? Yeah. So this is the other one that is part of the second... um Second batch of games. Right, right. Yeah, nice. This is, this is official. So we, ju- I had a little look at a YouTube video of this one last night where you can pick your dancers here. Uh, I guess would make them symmetrical, right? Oh, yeah. And I think these are your instruments, possibly. That's, I think they're your dance moves. Oh, they're the moves. types of dance. They're, oh, yeah, cool. Yeah, they're controlling the little the boogies. And then we've got this uh, piano roll here. So. You can put in your, uh, your notes. Okay, yeah. Boom, boom. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I could not make heads or tails of this, but I knew in my gut that Adam was going to work it out immediately. Oh, oh so you can rotate in- different instruments. Yes, yeah, your synth. So you've got a, a fish is like a little so kind of sawtooth. Yeah. Nice. Mm-hmm. Oh, okay, let's make them all that. Boop, boop, boop. Um, That's more your like your square synth pad, yeah, right? Yeah. Um. Ooh. <laughs> what does B do? Tap B to play. What's that fuck in the middle? To play me- to play measles. Yeah, to play I- measles. D pad to to play measure, I suppose. Oh yeah. Um, not sure what that button's meant to be. So, dun, dun. here we go. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, you've only got this limited quiet. Can I go an octave up? Oops. Fuck. Yes, I think you, you can. can. Yeah, yeah, there you can. go. Yeah. Uh, uh, 
This is this is the one that's, uh, you know, I'm trying to avoid. <laughs> I'm in a little Discord for the playdate. I'm trying to avoid, mm. like, spoilers. So there's, like, a channel for, like, week one, week two. So it's, like, cool going in there and seeing what people have oh. made of all the games so far. This so far out of the four has the most kind of mixed response. Like, people that are oh, yeah. people that are real heads for this kind of stuff are, like, you can. this is pretty cool. Like, you can make some really awesome stuff on it. There's a couple of YouTube videos of people that have made some pretty incredible stuff. Mm. And then there's other people being, like, this is just a utility that I'm never going to use that's kind of a waste of a uh, game. But it's cool mm. that they're putting, you know, they're, go- they're, they're trying a bit of everything on here. Yeah. I like the sort of sound that you can make with this thing. I just don't quite understand why some of these notes aren't available here. I don't know if it's trying to, like, push me into being in a certain key or something. You see how they've oh. got those white squares on them? Oh, yeah. And yeah, maybe these, it's meant to be major key. These ones that are dots don't have... The option for them, which is weird, because that's just a B. Yeah, uh, I think you because I think you're zoomed in at the moment on the interface. Like there's, uh, am I, I like there's... down here somewhere? Uh, Where am I? What's this button do? Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> and again, it, it gives you it gives you no guidance on no. <laughs> like how to use it. What is happening? Yeah, <laughs> I guess this is just like the equivalent of being like remix. Oh, okay, DJ Khaled. <laughs> Jason Derulo. It's <laughs> <laughs> pretty nice. DJ. All right, whip, so, whip, whip. Uh, oh, a collab with those two where it's just them both <laughs> screaming their names. Now, for should four we minutes. go clock or martini glass? Martini glass. Gotta go martini go glass. Go up towards martini glass. <laughs> what, what the what? fuck is happening? Yeah, what is okay, that? Mean? So I think these are drums. Oh yeah, there you oh, go. Oh my Down goodness. I love a I'd love a drum beat. You know what? I don't mind a good drum beat. Let's just have a simple Yep. Okay, now we're cooking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> Me and Ben are both bopping away we are. on the corner of his bed. <laughs> Pathetic. <laughs> uh, that would be like a crash? Oh, no, that's... Yeah, nice. That's a bit much, actually. A drummer being like, tone it down. <laughs> Less is more when it comes to drums. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh. <laughs> fish, fish, fish. Oh, that's not right. <laughs> fish, bird, fish. Nah, nah. That's what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to do Bohemian Rhapsody, but I can't do all the notes. <laughs> nah, 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 nah. So to I'd go like... from, this is frustrating how limited it is, <laughs> yeah. to, I'm going to try and cram all 15 minutes of Bohemian Rhapsody in here. All right, we, 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 Let's go rock nah, opera. Nah, 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 nah. Imagine doing a, if you were like a musician and you come out and like, with the empty stage, mm-hmm. orcs chord, you come out and you just jack the play date in. And you just sing it along to this loop that you've made. Man, now, if you could, I would, I'd watch that. Yeah. One, one thing about this that people probably would have noticed, I don't know if it's because we're plugged into the computer and doing the capture at the same time and everything, mm. but it isn't it isn't playing smoothly. It's right. like hitching up every now and again. So with music, it's super noticeable <laughs> that that is. And now what we'll do is we'll get some of those octopuses in to make oh. a little melody over the top. Okay. Not that note, though. Is that an octopus? I think I it was so. A bird. I, I thought it was thought, a bird. Oh, it could be a bird. I was thinking the top right was the eye and then the bottom left was like oh. a squid. Knocks on the beach. This fucking octopus <laughs> kept trying to steal my chips. <laughs> could happen. Could happen. <laughs> It'd be a notable story, too. You would tell people. <laughs> I watched my octopus teacher. I didn't know what the fuck that thing was. <laughs> yeah, you got taught by a bird. Who hasn't? <laughs> Do you hear that? Yeah, yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. right. Yeah. Sure. A nightmare. It is probably because it's going through through a USB cable. Yeah. Maybe I think there is a thing for once you take it out of the editor, it might play a bit smoother. Right. Oh, yeah. sure. Just kind of like play it instead of sure. If you go, if you click on the robot face, once you get this down, you gotta you gotta work on those dance moves as well. Because if I'm here in Bohemian Rhapsody, there's no way I'm doing this. There's no way me, 
my pizza friend, my cactus friend, and mm. my two rabbit friends. Well, we've got to get. Like we've got to find headbangers, right? <laughs> Surely there's a headbanger move. Yeah, and can we change it from a pizza and a rabbit to um, Wayne and Gal? <laughs> and there are the two friends who are in the car. <laughs> yeah, whoever those other two guys so are. So you're and saying Rob Lowe. <laughs> you're saying that at some point I'm able to to wrap this up and, and just so. play the hit, whole thing. Yeah, if you hit that button, I think it'll, this middle one. No, the the play pause maybe. Now I think that will pause it. Yeah. I think there's Weird. a way. To, <laughs> go, uh, there's a way to what get about out the, the robot? Editor. Or is the robot going to delete the whole thing? I'm not maybe. Sure. <laughs> okay. Go back. Oh, there we go. Oh, there it is. Open. Uh, open. Just try going... Just going back, maybe? I reckon this is us. That sounds better. <laughs> what was that middle button again? Yeah, that was yeah. doing all sorts of funky, weird shit, wasn't it? This... Oh, I wish it wouldn't hitch, but... <laughs> I can't even get it done. Yeah, now we're cooking. I have no idea what's happening. I think maybe this would run a little better on the actual thing because yeah, yeah. the sure. hitching and shit that is happening with it uh, on here is one of the worst experiences I've ever had <laughs> in my life. <laughs> Just change the dance move to headbanging and we can uh, we can wrap call this it a day. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, okay. Backwards plant. Du, 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 du. Tampon. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I like the the tampon dance. You guys do that. <laughs> on the edge. Oh wait. Oh, they've got like a sequence, I see. Oh! So let's go tampon, ice cube. Um, oh, double, double tampon. tampon. That's a Heavy pad. flow, yeah. <laughs> and uh, tissues. Out of tampons. Oh, a dab. Rough. Let's add more, more dance moves in. Oh, what was... Do the, do the B. Yeah, the queen B. <laughs> it is not happy with this. <laughs> <laughs> oh, because we've gone into... Little bow buns? We've gone into the bit where we've not programmed music for. Oh, uh, sure, oh. sure. So let's uh, let's ignore those. Oh, right. Turn them off. Yeah, just have nothing, please. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is a fucking nightmare. All right, let's be quiet for a bit so everyone can hear the song. Everyone's got their new ringtones now? Yeah, yeah. All right. Uh, this is the Adam Knox remix of Bohemian Rhapsody. Tap B. Oh, oh, okay. <laughs> oh, you can do a little uh, I think remix. We're just, we're just going back to the start every time we press split B. And then if the arrows would allow us to quick hop between the different measures that we've made. Oh, here. yeah. It is infuriating that they've put that little button over the... <laughs> It's it, very it strange. It really seems like a thing that someone would have caught at some point. Yeah. What does the crank do with this, by the way? I haven't cranked it once. I don't think it uses well, it. other than earlier this morning. Oh. <laughs> that is <laughs> awesome, dude. Fuck. Ladies and gentlemen, YouTube will try to cancel us. <laughs> <laughs> uh, this is cool. I, I would love to see it running um, a little smoother. Mm. Yeah. I'm not sure quite why it was. Because now it's like hopping along just fine. Yep. So maybe while we were programming it, it just takes a little bit more than it's capable of. <laughs> sure, you know what sure. you could do? Unplug it from the capture thing and then we'll just end the video with you just playing the audio <laughs> off the play date into the mic. <laughs> <laughs> that could be fun. I'm worried we'll break it because you know what? <laughs> I don't trust this thing anymore. I, I would love to know as well why this piano roll. Oh, there we go. Now we can do every note. Oh. That's weird. Changes the tune. Yeah, change the key. So I guess this is just like, yeah, different. You can select different scales if you want to be guided mm. into something that will make it sound decent. And then here you can do free for the, all the, the white notes. It's funny to have this music editing software that's like pretty robust for what it is and then have a thing up the top that is not really of interest to anyone using it, but seems to be to the detriment of <laughs> yes. the smoothness of the software. All right, cool. Well, that's the uh, Teenage Engineering OP1 <laughs> that we have shown Hey, go, if you go back to the main menu, Knox. Uh, sure. I want to show you, like, maybe just one more thing on here that I think you'll be into. Okay. A game that I think you'll enjoy. Go down to Squish. 
squish. Oh, with Ooh. the cane. Yeah. All right. I think this is the sort of shit that you might enjoy. So this is like, this has dropped you kind of in pretty yeah. deep, but you got to, you can move into those little blocks. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then it's, you take um, them over and you got to, oh. you got to cover all the X's with them and yeah. then the exit will open up. But when you move in and you can only, oh, you can only get out when you're block. up against a wall. And uh, right. if you if you get in and move that around, it'll um. I mean that seems like the. Oh one. yeah. Oh, but you need another block next to it for it to come out. Yeah, you need to be yeah. So, uh, how could I ever possibly do this then if it will only? What about with the other one of the? Oh, other? oh goodness gracious me! So I've got to build the whole thing into a shape that will. Line up next to these. Oh, oh, oh. oh my! Well, I fucked it, but this is cool. <laughs> yeah, how yeah, do you yeah, get out? A, yeah. This is this is one of my favorites. This is another homebrew one. Yeah, no, this, this is, is the very sort of, smart. This is the sort of shit that I absolutely froth on. Mm. Yeah. So I would have to go. Uh, I think I've already used one. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Let's go back. So you press and B just to rewind a step. Yep. Okay. This one would have to be. Oh, how would you do this? So this one would have to be, uh, like. No, it couldn't be there. It would have to be here. Mm -hmm. And then uh, these guys... Hey, Ben, this is part of my devious plan. I couldn't get past this level last night. <laughs> so this is my equivalent of, like, getting an older brother to do yes. it for me. <laughs> hey, Adam, why don't you check this out? <laughs> now I can't come out of here. <laughs> uh, so I would have to take this one. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh. Uh, but now I can't go Oh, down you can't there. get out, yeah. yeah. Uh, so this one can come... Oh. Here, but that doesn't fucking work. If all this console ended up being was just shit like this, mm. I'd be in heaven. This is awesome. This is yeah. yeah, not even using the crank. And I think you can get this on other. I think you can can just get this on PC. Oh okay. Um, this person just like because that's the thing. There are a lot of that like um that little dungeon crawler thing that guy has made. Uh, that person has made it for Playdate. Um, <sighs> But then there's a lot of stuff where it's people that have made these little games for PC that they've then like now porting over, um, because I guess the software is Whoops. very easy for them to use. No. no. Mm. How do I get out? Uh, this looks cool. Yeah, that that's the thing that excites me about the play date is um, as many little cool ideas as this thing is set up to generate. Yeah. Can I show you one more? Yes. One more. The, again, another one I think you'll really like. Ch Chestress. Have you Chestress? played this before? I've never played Chestress. So uh, go to... Uh, press the menu button. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, go replay tutorial. Oh, yeah. Because this is pretty uh, neat. It's not about black versus white, thank you, finally. Instead, mm. it's you against the board. Okay. Yes, the class issues are the real issues. <laughs> the board of directors are the ones who need to get each turn. You're given a block of three places. Move the block with that. Once you place your block, both teams start oh. attacking. Their teams only make moves to take their opponent team's pieces. These two, I'm not going to be able to do this right now. I would have to sit down with my like <laughs> half moon spectacles on. Change the pieces. Stronger pieces get to attack before okay. the weaker ones. Right. Uh, this is a cool idea. Mm. Yeah. It's going to overwhelm me right now. If there's a tie, the so basically you're getting three little chess pieces yeah. you're choosing where to put them on the board and you're trying to the game's over when there's yeah when it's too full and you can't put any new blocks down so you're trying to clear as many off as you can right so you're not like versing white or black you're just trying to put put pieces down that are going to get rid of as many right. other pieces as possible um, and you, you're just getting three little random blocks and then it's making the moves and you get three other random blocks. Right, so I don't want to take the queen straight away necessarily because the queen is going to be able to take more pieces than... Well, but it, you just keep getting... There's not like a set number. You just keep getting new ones at random. But that's what I mean. Oh, okay, I see. Ah. So you want to just that. take out as many as you can on each turn. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Oh, and there's two moves in the next one. I missed that on the side. Okay. Oh, yes. Uh, well, I'm not going to do... And so this is just an endless thing of a high score game. Like, just try and do your mm. best. There's no yep. levels. And it, it, when you get to a point where, yeah, you can't fit three in a line anywhere on the board, then right. it ends. That's awesome. By the way, I've got a vibrator in my asshole that is telling me how to do these moves. 
That's a chess, current chess. Yeah. Magnus. <laughs> uh, Magnus and, oh, I forget the guy who did it. Magnus is the guy who accused him. Oh, yeah, like N- Niall or Ned mm, or something, something like that. Na- Nam- now, I'll tell you this. Big I chess have, controversy. Yeah. I have no idea what that reference is, but it still worked for me. <laughs> <laughs> can I, so I can't place over pieces, so I'll put no. it here so that guy can take the, yeah. And now it's just all pawns, baby. What I love this, this music too. Drive. Super yeah. chill. Mm. This is a fun little cool thing that that I could imagine being such a. Uh, 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 it's a cool idea. Moorish time. Yeah. Sink. I think again. I think you can get this on a bunch of stuff. I think this, you can just play this on PC. Yeah, I might. I might get it. Yeah, it's cool. It's a yeah. cool idea. It's a. It's you know. Someone looking at the chessboard and being like, "But what if I fucked with mm. this? What if we turn chess into a game?" <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I don't know how to fix this. I can't find a good place for these ones. <laughs> People have been crying out for chess to be improved upon. Yeah, well, they thought they'd done it when they invented Simpsons chess. <laughs> well, Fine. battle chess. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Chess 2. Finally. Oh. So this is going to be season two of The Queen's Gambit, I believe. Yeah. Mm. Her developing this. <laughs> <laughs> It'll be uploaded to YouTube. And have commentary from three kind boys who have uh, finished up a little look at the play date. Yeah. yeah, there you go, folks. That's the play date That's for nice. you. Um, look, yeah, I'll talk more about it on the podcast if you've found this video independently. Mm-hmm. Um, Tape worm. <laughs> we do a uh, yeah, we do a weekly podcast called Filthy Casuals where we uh, talk about news uh, in gaming and we review stuff as well. So go listen to that yeah. if mm-hmm. you are not already familiar. But um. Yeah, this is the play date. I really recommend it. I think it's awesome. I, you can still get on and pre-order now. It will take a while to get to you yes. mm. because they are, you know, they've been like everyone hit with delays with getting this stuff out. But um, yeah, I can't recommend it enough. I think it's an awesome little piece of hardware. Yeah, hell yeah. <laughs>